Welcome back! Alright, Whole Hog. I'm really not that familiar with this level. I've obviously finished it and played it before, but I don't remember it like I do the other one. So, this should be interesting. This is going to be purely a reaction-based kind of experience. I feel like I definitely went... Whoa, this is way harder. Um, I was going to say, I definitely went through those spikes. But, whoa! Yeah, no, this is much more intense. I am really not looking forward to the relic for this one. I suspect this will be awful. <laughs> but, we'll see. I mean, we got 24, that's not a huge amount. Damn it. This is really hard. This is really very hard. Okay then. <laughs> I really do look forward to seeing people's first playthroughs of this game though. Because it will be fascinating. At least I think so. Nice. That's good. Yay, checkpoint! Halfway through, roughly. Nice. That's good. The level itself isn't actually that long, which is a plus. Yeah, the level's really short. Okay, no, the relic won't be that bad. The relic won't be bad. It'll just be about getting through it first time. And assuming I can... The hardest part was the beginning. Assuming I can just do it as I did, I should be fine. Cool! Thumbs up for us! Yeah! Yeah? Yeah! Okay, we're done with that. But yeah. No, that went quite well. I'm very happy with that. <laughs> that, was, that was... Compared to uh, Sunset Vista, that was lovely. 30 seconds. 30 seconds? I guess, yeah. Yeah, sure, yeah. That's, that seems quite short, but yeah, I guess if there's enough, uh, if there's enough crates, then yeah, I guess so. Cool, now it's just, you know, a case of not screwing it up. Easier said than done. Yeah, once I got past this one, I was fine, so... Let's hope it's as easy as it was before. That would be nice. Yeah, that definitely helps. <laughs> ah, I screwed up the jump. Yeah, like, the 10 seconds of stoppage that you get there is pretty good. Is stoppage the right word? That sounds like something Ron Stoppable would say. I'm gonna get my stoppage! Yo, KP! I don't know if that's a good impression or not. You be the judge. And tell me how bad it is in the comments, please. I thought I, did, I thought I screwed up again. That was that was mildly terrifying. Ooh, it's scary at times. Well, that's a pretty good time. That's definitely platinum. And is that on par with the best time? Or... Or... What? Because <laughs> it... I'm pretty sure the best time was 25-something. It might have been an earlier 25, but I'm still very proud of that. That was good. That was a good time. It's nice platinum. To be fair, those ones are actually really easy to platinum. Just don't screw up in every box. And every box is really easy to hit. So, yay! Oh, wow. Wow, that's close. That's very close. That's cool. That's pretty cool. That's evil and mean, but cool. Well done, you, for beating me. That's 
That's cool. Likes the flex. So that's why. Just like, just he has an audience. So it's like, yeah, flex these guns. <gasps> the guns. I'm hardly worried about this boss, I must say. Because it's not massively challenging or anything. But. I don't know. I'm used to doing it with a couple of Garakus. And this game is elected to not give me any. Which is actually kind of cool. I like that it's different. I wonder how much that would actually hurt. Probably a lot. <laughs> I mean, it's only a rock hitting you in the face. I feel like one appears on the left side. Oh, that was close! Does one appear on the left? No, not really. Done! Nice! That went well. <laughs> That's pretty great. Koala conked. Oh, that's great. Well done. Well, this has been a very successful video so far. Seven minutes in, or less than seven minutes, and we've already done two full levels. One was a boss, but still. So I'll, I'll take that. That's not bad. Island number three, we go. Heavy. Oh, yeah, heavy machine. I was thinking it was going to be Cortex Power, but yeah, heavy machinery, of course. Yeah, I like this level. Heavy machinery is cool. Failing a bonus round doesn't cost lives. I wasn't paying attention. It's not a, uh, it's not a coloured gem, is it? I don't remember it being coloured, but maybe it is. This is one of the first levels they showed off. Um, and as I saw it, I was just like, yeah. Yeah, they're doing it right. They're nailing it. And people still nitpicked. Because of course they did. But I just saw it, and like... There are some people who are like, oh, it looks exactly the same. Like, are you blind? No, it doesn't. <laughs> oh, that sucks. Um, like, I don't know how people could think this looks exactly the same. Because it really doesn't. It looks so much nicer. There's just so much nice... Oh, it's just... It's just the little details here and there. Which really sells it. It sells it well. But, oh well. Can't please everyone. Or anyone in the Crash fandom, it seems. Um, <laughs> judging from the amazing comments I've seen on some of the videos I've uploaded. Oh, we're so close to 99 lives. This is exciting. I wonder what happens when you get 99. Probably nothing. It's a very prestigious moment. Are you ready for it? Actually, can you go to 100? Maybe... No... Well, as soon as we... Yay! I was gonna say, as soon as we got it... We, we lost it again. But that's interesting to know there is a trophy for getting 99 lives. It's interesting and good to know. Because... I suspect we're going to need to, uh... Do that for all three games. Easier said than done. This game does hand out lives quite nicely. Uh, I don't think the same can be said for free. Two, I agree, probably can. But free, not as much. It certainly gives you lives, don't get me wrong. But I, I wouldn't say as much as two or one. I could be wrong in that statement, though. I love the music as well. Just just everything about this game. It just breathes joy. It's it is spectacular. It's mildly disappointing that the screenshot of me getting 99 lives is probably gonna be 
a black screen because of when I died. Unless it's exactly as I collect the life, then you'll see Crash dying, which is pretty great. Yeah, I, I'll say, I don't think this is a coloured gem level, but if it is, admittedly it's not too difficult as levels go. It's, I don't remember it being difficult. Yeah, I think the third island's my favourite. It has some of the harder levels, for sure, but it has some of the most interesting levels as well. Plus, admittedly, um, I do like factory levels. Obviously, oh, damn, uh, like, notably, uh, Fear Factory and stuff from Duncan Country, they're up there with some of the best. Um, but... Actually, I'll tell you what, uh, Donkey Kong Country Tropical Freeze had a really good Fear Factory base level. I, was, uh, I also had a really good remix of the, uh, the music. This is going to be tough. Oh no, I screwed it up! Oh, I could have done it as well. I panicked. It's quite difficult, actually. They have certainly made these difficult. Like, the Crash 2 were challenging, but not, like, this level challenging. They never intended for you to get all these. They're just like, oh, you will place them anywhere. I'm like, <laughs> yeah, what will this do? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, up in the sky where you can't see it, no problem. Yeah, it's all good. There. No Aku Akus and all that. So how difficult is the Brio stage going to be for this one? I don't remember. I do you remember an Aku Aku though? That's always handy. Oh, they've oh they've definitely changed this. So in. The original version, it was like a red thing, with like, it was, it was basically just like a solid red mass, um, and as a kid, I thought it was like the rings of an oven, um, so I didn't touch it, and at the end of the level, you need to, like, go on loads of them, because they're, well, basically trampolines. Well done me! <laughs> they're basically trampolines. Um, so you need to go on them to finish the level. It just didn't, like, I just didn't know what they were. Um, and didn't know how to finish the level. I was really confused for a long time. And I was like, oh! But yeah, this one's much easier to tell that it is not the ring of an oven or a very hot surface or whatever. They probably did it because, like, someone told them that or one of the members of the team thought that as a kid or something. Because it wouldn't surprise me. Like it really just—it just looked dangerous more than a like bounce pad. Now there's the final Brio token. What am I in for here? Let's find out. Thirty. Okay. Oh, I remember this one. It's going really well so far. Um, yeah, I remember this one. This might take a while. This one's not easy. This one is not easy at all. Okay. Oh my lord, that's a much bigger gap than I anticipated. That is way bigger. Okay. Right, noted. Absolutely massive gap, good. 
There's also one up there that I see. To be fair, I would have had time to react to that one because it's like in plain sight. Oh my god. This is somewhat stupidly terrifying. Thank you, Lord. Six lives, as per usual. Well, I can't exactly utilize all those lives, but I appreciate them nevertheless. I just have too many, it seems. Oh, we're at the end of the level. Sweet. Yeah, these are the uh, bounce pants I mentioned. They're fun. They bring about great joy. <laughs> no, to be fair, they do. They're pretty awesome. There they are. Yeah, there's loads of lives in this level. And that'll be 86. This is where we discover it's a coloured level. No, it is not. Sweet. Oh, wow. We're over halfway. Nice. Good for us. Ta-da! That's pretty cool. I think that's cool. That's worth a round of applause, right? Yeah! Yeah, go us! Yeah! Build that ego. Yeah, enough. Uh, okay, well, we still got a, uh, a relic to do, so... Next level, presumably, is Cortex Power, right? It is! Really? Cortex Power isn't a coloured gem? Huh, okay. I thought it was. What am I looking at? 157. Okay. I like how the best time is 155. Well, as long as I get the, the gold gem, that's all. The gold gem? The gold relic, that's all that matters. So. Let, let's go for it. Let's see what you got, game. Show me your muscles. I just want to get rid of you. You know what? No. You know what? I, I, I don't care. Stop caring. Good start. <laughs> this is uh, it's gonna be that kind of relic. Cool. Okay. I remember I played Crash 1 on uh, the day of uh, Crash's 20th anniversary and I didn't get 99 lives because I sacrificed one life in the final boss because that way I will have died exactly 20 times throughout the game, which I felt really proud about. It wasn't 100% or anything. Oh, God damn it. It was just to complete it, but I was just like, yeah, dying 20 times, that's too great. But I, that means I won't finish on 99 lives. It's a sacrifice I'm willing to take. <laughs> I'll have to do this. I don't know why I said take. Make is a better word for that, but still. It was still, it was my sacrifice and it was worth it. For the 20. For the symbolism. Please get out of my face. There we go. One fifty five, right? No, one fifty seven. The other person got one fifty five. This might be harder than it looks. Might. No guarantees. I was going to say, because this level isn't massively complicated, just follow the rules and you'll be fine. But, at the same time, there's a lot you have to do. Can you get free Aku Akus? In theory, yes. Yes, you can. Assuming this is still one. Which it isn't. Interesting. I kind of wasted a lot of time there, which probably isn't good. Isn't the Platinum 135? How the hell? How the actual hell? I 
I have no idea how you're supposed to do that. Please give me something. Damn it. I've not done it because of that. Actually, I know exactly what the real reason is. The real reason is the other trampoline. But at least I know what I did wrong. I know where the the items lie, and I know what I'm doing. So, that's not a problem. What is a problem is that one, 135. I'm not reading that wrong. It did say 135, right? I just don't know how. How do you save that much time? Unless there's some kind of exploit. Which there might be. I just don't know about it. Alright, like, double check. No, 136. Like, close enough. 136. Like, how? How do you save 20 seconds on this? Because I know where I lost time. I was being sloppy in areas. I was just trying to learn it. But 20 whole seconds is a long time. Especially in a race scenario. Nice. <laughs> that was pretty slick. But not as slick as that. Hmm. I think you'll agree. Even like and subscribe for the amazing pro skills we've got on display here. I doubt you'll see any like these on YouTube. Unless you look at any channel that claim they are doing pro fidget spinner skills. There, they are the proest. They might be better than what I have to offer. I mean, I could be wrong. But for those, those videos, they really they get my heart pumping. They're so sexy. I mean, I love a good fidget spinner, but those mad skills that they show off. I mean, could you get any more fidget spinner sex on legs? I don't think so. It's just, it's too good. I don't know what I just said in the last like 30 seconds, but <laughs> I'm sure it was gold. As in, always believe in your soul. You've got the power to know you're indestructible. Always believe in. Please do not die. I can sing better than that, I just choose not to. I have my moments. God damn it. Oh, cool. I did get it. I was going to say, like, I kind of need that. Like, I'm, I'm only slightly desperate. You don't really get it. Like, I know how to save time here and there. We're still at the crossroads where I... I'm at the 130 mark. How do I complete the rest of the level in six seconds? Six. I just don't know. That's a three second save, right? Ah, damn it. That's disappointing. I was going to be like, super pro skill. We're well, still better than, it's still the best one out of the lot. So, yay. But, I mean, how do you... It's just all about learning the level, being faster. Knowing when to go fast, knowing what risks to take. Probably sacrificing an Aku Aku here and there, but still, like, it's very difficult. But I think that's where we're going to end it, so thank you very much for watching, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, share the video around, uh, I've also got Patreon if you're interested, you can check that out. But, yeah, thank you very much for watching, see you next time, take care, bye bye.